So to answer that question, I'm going to start by answering a simple, simpler question, which is how we know that the universe is expanding at the moment. And the reason we know that is from the positions and motions of galaxies near us. That if you put on a plot like this that shows time on this axis and distance away from us on this axis nearby galaxies, then the further a galaxy is away from us, the faster it's moving away from us. And that implies a cosmological expansion. So the next part of this question is, having measured that the universe is expanding now, what's going to happen in the future here? Well, the one thing that we know will affect the motions of these galaxies is the force of gravity from the mass of them and the dark matter as well. And that will slow down the expansion, possibly something like this, or possibly something more extreme like this, where the gravity is strong enough to recollapse the universe. To find out which of these options uh, is actually taking place, astronomers have made surveys of the amount of mass in the universe and discovered that there's not nearly enough to recollapse the universe like this, so that the universe will go on expanding forever. However, it turns out that when people made more detailed measurements of the expansion of the universe, that the expansion isn't slowing down. It seems it's actually getting faster. An astounding discovery that won the Nobel Prize in 2011 and is the subject of a huge number of investigations now, both theoretical and observational. Uh, and as far as the theory goes, we don't have any idea why this expansion is taking place. People have names for it, such as dark energy and quintessence, but really it's going to take some physicists to come along and really understand this, and there's at least one more Nobel Prize to be won for understanding why the expansion of the universe is now accelerating.